back with a lawnmower video. Um, I am working on my Craftsman GT5000, 2004 stick shifts. Uh, when we first bought it, there were no brakes. So I took off the transaxle right here. It's a manual. Um, right here, this is where the disc brake sits. And as you can see, there's like no, well, I don't know if you can really see it, but there's like no teeth in there. So I think I'm gonna tack weld it. I'm just gonna most likely tack weld it in there. And then I cleaned it out. Well, tried my best. It's kinda heck of dirty. Um, also, here's the pulley that goes onto the transaxle. I think I'm gonna put the seat on the front and kinda swap the pulleys out to make this thing go faster. I don't know yet. Yeah, I'm just gonna get to work. So, um, I am going to take, well, I'm going to drill a hole through here at the hub and then put a, a tap it and then put a screw in here and then right here I want to like, I'm going to use like some kind of a thing, I don't, I forgot what the tool is called, and like make a little slot, that way when I, I can screw it in and it can slide freely, but not the right way. Um, that way I could screw it in, and then I put the brake pads in there. Um, yeah. That way I can have brakes, and maybe make this go faster. So, I drilled a hole on the disc right here, and I tapped it, and now I could screw it in right here, so... Now when the wheels spin, this disc spin. And I also drill the hole on the shaft, that way I could be, be able to have some play when I'm moving side to side. And then, you know, like, and it, it, it was kind of worn out, so I had to add a washer here. Locks in, I don't know if you can really tell, but it like locks in in there. So yeah, I'm pretty much ready to go. I just gotta put a pulley on. I found another pulley from our other mower that I did a engine swap on this one. And it was a hydrostat automatic one. So it had a smaller pulley, but um, it had different teeth. So I don't know yet. I think I'm just gonna measure it, do the calculations for it and maybe buy a new pulley before I put that bad boy back on the mower. Cause like, um, if I put this up, I, I don't know. I'm, I possibly can do it, like put the new pulley in without take, dropping the whole transaxle, but I don't know yet. So yeah, we'll see. So, um, I decided that I am just gonna put on the pulley. I don't want to just buy a new pulley. And I and then I noticed that there is this hole where the transaction goes, so I'm pretty sure I should be able to just take off the clip, drop the whole pulley, and change the pulley. So yeah, I, that's what I'm gonna do right now. I just put the pulley on, clipped it on. No, is this supposed to be what? I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna screw this in right here. Um, I made a handbrake. Well, like I hooked up the brake board to the handbrake, but it's gonna be a lot of work. And um, so I'm just gonna just dis disconnect it over there and hook it back to where it was. And then I'm gonna toss in the transaxle underneath the mower, and I'm gonna screw it in. Look at everything up and I'll be good to go.
So I finally finished it. I screwed in the transaxle um, in the middle of when I was screwing the back foot in. I realized it's only just two screws in the back and up there there's one two screw and then no more two screws. And I just, and it, I could take off the transaxle without like this. But I did the brakes. I hooked it up to the foot pedal. Um, I decided I'm gonna do it later. Well, yeah, it was gonna be fun, exciting, and I just threw out.